Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing a Birchbox unboxing video and I'm going to be sharing with you what I received in my Birchbox this month. If you're interested to see, then please keep watching. Please make sure you give this video a thumbs up and you're subscribed to my channel. And I will see you guys next time in my next video. Bye guys! Alright, so for those of you who don't know what Birchbox is, it is a subscription service just like um, Ipsy, BoxyCharm, things like that, where you pay $10 a month, just like how Ipsy is, you pay the $10 a month, they send you out a little box full of beauty related products like skincare, hair care, makeup, anything like that, that you w might like to try out, and they send you, I think it's like five or six products for the $10. And they are sample sizes, some are deluxe sample sizes, some may be full size depending on what the product is. So it's a pretty good deal for $10 a month, especially if you're kind of just getting introduced to beauty products. I really like doing it because I really like trying out new skincare brands and everything. So in my Birch Box, I do notice I receive more skincare options rather than an Ipsy. So this is the box for this month. It's super cute all summary and then inside there is a little postcard with the benefit products on it it just says pre-order now at birch box it's all of the new benefit brow collection so there's all the products that they have it kind of tells you what you can use them for all the shades and everything which is pretty cool so and then here is the little card on the front it tells you the theme of the card on the back it tells you all of the products that you received in your birch box with all the prices and the little description which is really awesome I really wish that like Ipsy would really start doing this only because I really like it and I really think it's useful just a little description of what you are receiving in your bat in your box and it does tell you the full size price like what the product will retail for at the full size which is really cool okay so the first thing that's in here is this is the Ardency in smooth ride supercharged eyeliner in black and I'm so excited for this because I have been dying to try this every time I go on Sephora it's always sold out and I can never get my hands on it and I've heard such good things about it I have a really hard time with um eyeliner staying in my waterline. I use the Urban Decay one and it just doesn't stay for me. So I've heard really good things about this one that the staying power is amazing on this one. So I'm really excited for this. Um, this is just a little, um, like a little travel size, which I'm totally fine with. Eyeliner always lasts me such a long time because I don't use it in my waterline every day. But I'm so excited for this and that's, it just kind of, ooh, that's really cool. I'm excited for it so like I said you can buy this on Sephora I don't think that you can buy it in store I think you can only purchase it on the website I'm not 100% sure though I know in my Sephora we don't have Ardency in so I've always had to go on the website for it but it does retail for $20 which is not bad and then the next thing that is on here is a little perfume sample this is Aquamudo it says it this beachy scent features salty winds, sandy shores, making you feel as if you've been whisked to the South Pacific. Hmm. Okay. And it says that the full size retails for $85, is obviously it's not full size. Let's see what this says. Ooh. Oh. I don't know. I don't know. That, that's weird. It, smells very kind of manly like musky and not I don't think musky kind of like just spicy I don't know there's like a scent in it that just doesn't it's, it's giving it a weird after scent I don't know that's I'll just pass that one along <laughs> and then the next thing is the Dr. Jart everyday UV sun fluid broad spectrum SPF 30 which um Hello. We all need SPF. I could have used this yesterday because I was out in the sun and I got burnt. As you can probably see on my shoulders, I got burnt. So this is always good to have, especially it's like a nice little travel size. So this is always good to have. Um, Dr. Jar, it says that it's a lightweight, non-sticky SPF. And it's 
obviously an SPF 30. The full size retails for $34. But this is a pretty good size, especially in the summertime, like if you're traveling and everything. I mean, this is a pretty good size to just like put on your shoulders or your face or something. So this is a pretty good size for SPF if you don't use it all the time. Like I don't use it all the time. So that's pretty cool. All right. So the next thing is the Kerastase mask for frizzy hair deep conditioning hair mask to restore flexibility movement and lipids for added softness now i am really really excited for those of you who don't know what kerastase is um kerastase is basically a more expensive version of l'oreal hair products they i'm not sure if you can get them in like altas or sephora's um I'm not 100% sure. I do know that this is a salon quality hair brand. I used to work with this product a lot when I did work in a salon. And these products, oh my god, you guys, these products are so nice. They leave your hair so smooth, so silky, so shiny. Everybody loves this. It is pricier for what you are getting, but if you don't, if you're a total hair junkie, you don't care how much you're spending on your hair products, this product is so nice. It, it's, I love their hair products. Um, I can't find them in my salon centric, unfortunately. I can only order online, but I mean, this product, these products are amazing. So this is basically, this is a hair mask that you would leave on your hair for five or ten minutes, and then it says it's mainly for frizzy hair. I mean, I'm still going to give it a try even though I have fine thin hair. Whatever. It's just going to make it soft, hopefully. Oh, that smells so good. And all of their products, they all smell so good. They all smell clean. Like, they don't smell, like, chemically or anything. These, this smells so good. Like, it just smells, like, clean. Like, good, clean products. Ugh, I can't wait to use this. I'm so excited I got this. Um... So I will link it down below where you can find this at because, like I said, I don't know if you can get it at Sephora. I don't know if you can get it at Ulta. Um, as far as I know, you could only get it at a salon that actually sold it. I don't know if someone else picked it up, but I will find it for you guys, and I will link it down below. This is not a full size. This is kind of like a deluxe sample, as I was saying. Um, but the full size of this does retail for $62.50. It's a little expensive. Alright, so the last thing that I received in my birch box is this is the Kiehl's Precision Lifting and Pore Tightening Concentrate and it says that this serum is clinically tested to restore elasticity, tighten pores while lifting skin and redefined facial contours. Hmm. Sounds pretty promising. So... I've never tried any of the Kiehl's products before. I do know you can purchase it over at Target. I've never tried them before. Oh, citrus. It feels good. Um, But yeah, I'm really excited to try this because I've never tried any of the Kiehl's products before. I've always wanted to try their eye cream, like their under eye cream. But I've never actually have... Every time I go to Target, I forget to look for it, honestly. So I'm really excited to try this. I mean, and anything that's going to tighten up pores, I mean, who doesn't want that right <laughs> and then it says that this retails for oh 64 dollars the full so i would suggest making this bad boy last as long as you can so that is it for this month's birch box um i would say i'm very impressed with this month's birch box it is very hit or miss as i'm sure all of you guys know who received birch box it's a boxy charm everything like that every month is hit or miss you never know what you are getting in it so with this month i am actually pretty impressed i do like all of the products that i received in it other than i mean i could live without this little fragrance but i mean whatever i'll pass it on to someone or i don't know whatever um but yeah i really like everything that i got in my birch box and i'm really excited to try everything out um if you guys want, leave a comment down below, and I'll do, like, a follow-up video on the products that were in here. I'll do one on, like, the hair mask, the face serum, things like that. I can definitely do that if that's what you guys are interested in. So let me know how you guys feel about that. Also, let me know if you want to see more videos on... I was going to do more of, like, um, Birchbox vs. Ipsy, 
video, but I figured it might be too long depending on how much stuff came and what. So for now, I'm just going to keep them separate. If you guys do want to see like an Ipsy vs. Birchbox video and see which one that I like overall, let me know too down below and over on Instagram. Make sure you're following me over on Instagram. I am very active over there. I respond to everything. So make sure you guys let me know what you want to see. And I will definitely make it happen for you guys. So thank you guys for watching. Please make sure you're subscribed. Give my video a thumbs up. Follow me over on Instagram. And I will see you guys next time in my next video. Bye, guys.